Yo, it's Papa Mystic, and we're back with Hogwarts Legacy Part 4. And we're going to be attending some potions class, and then we're going to go see a little miss out in, I believe, Hogwild? Um, whatever it's called. Hogsweed. And we're going to have a lot of fun today. If you haven't watched 1, 2, or 3, those are up on the channel. Check them out. Everything I upload hits 4K. If you'd like some tips, check out the tips. I'm uploading those on a regular basis as I find them. Let's jump right in. Let's get into potions class and let's uh, find something to drink. Let's get to wizarding. Listen, while we're heading in here, don't forget to hit the red button. I bet you can't do it before I reach that spot. I bet he knows and more than he's letting on about the Goblin it? Rebellion. Don't forget to hit the bell button. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. Yes, sir. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each Ooh, of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Okay. I've needed it a lot. Like in part three, where I could not win the duel. Granted, if you watch part three, use a strong, even motion when crushing fair. your ingredients. If you agree with me, hit the comments. Was it fair that it was two against four in that duel? Come on. All right, let's crush some ingredients by spinning the mouse. Wee, that's easy. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. Okay. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. Just a pinch. Okay. We're doing good. Two drops. Oh, uh, three drops. <laughs> Sir. Okay. We're good at this. I'm a natural brewer. Oh, he's sneaking up on me. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Sure have it. Mm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. Well, then and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. All right. You got it. So let's go over to his office. Rebellion. What is that? Gold just sitting around. Hey, who just let you pick up the gold in the classroom? My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the room. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Ooh, what do you mean? Yes, but why does that matter to you? Brilliant! And it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Okay. Bit of a prodigy oh, with potions, Weasley. if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait. Are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fupa feather as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. Yo, this guy gonna have me steal something for him, I see. I'm gonna do it. 
I'll get you the Fuipa feather. feather, as long as you're certain Shark won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fuipa feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Okay, so we're gonna... We're just heading... Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as an Auror. I wish he talked about it more. Huh. Keep your potion stations organized and free of time. What is this? Memradem. Memorandum. Memorandum. Date 31st of December 1875. From Aurora Office. Subject Organ and Burks. Organ and Burks has had an increased amount of activity outside. Ordinary shops hours, particularly in the wee hours of the night, with suspicious deliveries being made to the shop's back entrance. Ooh. Given what we know of the shop's reputation, we are adding more awards to join those that have already been watching the shop. You are amongst the new additions. Further instruction to follow. Huh. So we're going to have to watch, keep our eye on Borgen and Burks, it looks like. Put that in the notes. Revelio. Anything special going on in this office? No. I hear whispers. Whistling should not be that color, Miss McDowell. These potions are on the collar. My Wigan World potions utter rubbish. Wish I could just replace it with one from Jay Pippins. Don't fret if you run out of ingredients. I simply grow most of what I need. Oh, cool. Professor Sharp said that Wigan World potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. Here's the Fwapa feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Endurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Yeah, let me know, bro. Let me know. Let me know when that's done. Let me get some. All right, back to... Proficiency in potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. Okay. So, brew potions from unlocked recipes at the potion station. We're going to need this. Twenty-four seconds. That won't take long. So the endurance potion is a potion that enhances the drinker's defense by covering them with a durable rocky skin. Um, please, I'll take it. I'll take like all the bottles. Listen, if you had a shelf, my bottle, my shelf would be full of the bottles of this. Because, well, only because that's the only thing I got on lock right now. But I'm telling you, we're gonna make a lot of this. Pick it up. Oh. Okay. I don't have the stuff for the others, so. And now we add the mallow sweet, and... I did. That's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to... Ah! Get it! Oh, the smell! Dragon dung! What happened? <laughs> Gareth messed up! <laughs> Well done, Gareth. Well done, Gareth. Okay, so if what I now? just brewed that, why don't I have it? That's what I want to know. So I'm not right. Weasley. Unless I need to brew two. I must need to brew two. So, sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Revelio. Yo. Okay, I was gonna Prepare say. Which your wizard always has a few potions on hand. Okay. I was gonna say. I, thought I brewed an Adorus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm not sure what you're talking about, Professor. You will not earn favor with me by failing to take responsibility for your actions. 
I suggest you heed my warning. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. Let's I confess see. I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this Let's class see. and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Okay. Pay particular okay. attention okay. in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location yeah. in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Hmm. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Yay! That's potions class, fam. All right, now we need to go see. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wigan Weld potion. Oh, thank you. That means a lot coming from a fellow Ravenclaw. Mm -hmm. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wigan Weld potion on their first try. Well done. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion making. Some students seem it's so confounded sad. by potion recipes, it's as if they're written in gobbledygook. A fascinating language, by the way. Neither here nor there, really, but I am a self-taught speaker. Okay. Merlin's beard, okay. good conversation is the enemy of free time. I must return my book, Gateway to the Far Stars, before my next class. Speaking of stars, we'll be in astronomy together. You'll love it. Professor Shaw is firm, but quite clever. See you soon, no doubt. No doubt, no doubt. That yeah, was an interesting up, class. Bro. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. Heard him talking about taking responsibility. You got Professor Sharp wasn't happy. Leave me out of your grand plans next time. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully he's already forgotten about it. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. Better. You better do it better. Oh, Ugh, my robes are going to what? reek from Garrus. Inspiration. Rebellion. Rebellion. Waste of turn. Anything? Nothing. Okay. Now uh, we're gonna go see the little mists at the halls. We... So, open up my map. Hogs win, maybe? Hogs field! Hogs field, my bad. Okay, so. Track that. Oh my. Time to walk, huh? Let's do it. Let's do it. Revelio. Off on another adventure, are we? Yes, I am. Oh, is that another door? Yeah, that's a door. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Is that? Field guide! Weaver Fountain. This fountain in the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeness of a wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather, despite rumors to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Cadogan. This is most assuredly not meant to be the wyvern of Y, slain by the likely knight in spite of himself. Um, that is Rebellion. Do -do -do -do. I wonder if you might be able to help me with a small, uh, project. Let's talk, Duncan. 
You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure you know, to meet you. you know, it, uh, I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. Well, That's you. nice to hear. I have had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is in fact warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, oh, we were learning me. to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, okay. and, well, right. mine There's unfortunately more. took the shape of a... a puff scheme. Surely you're joking. You can't possibly be afraid of a puff scheme. It may seem irrational to you, but my experience with them has been most upsetting. They eat bogies, you know. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some uh, have even taken probably. to calling me Puff Skeen Dunkeen. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. <laughs> I do not have to admit that. Everett said the same thing. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think, since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. What sort of plants yeah, should I you, expect you, in the hidden herbology corridor? Here, I haven't a clue. But have you seen the kinds of plants Professor Garlic grows? If the previous professor was anything like her, I'd imagine they're not exactly harmless. I'll see Very what well. I can do. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Yes, yes you shall. If you're gonna take that kind of credit. Hmm. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Sounds intriguing. Look, we are headed to see the lady. So stop playing games. We'll check that out on another adventure. I think that's fine. Off we go. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Guess I better. <laughs> you. We've been finding them. It's a relief to finally have an art. I really have made a mess of things. Incendium! Bill Guy Pig. Is everything all right? Oh, oh hello. One second. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. Cressida. And I'm afraid everything Cressida is not all right. Like I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation. Because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. That sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian really will see it that way. Just fly with me. I collect I've the books it. and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. Oh, then you there are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Mm, yeah, why did he tell on you? Why did Army tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Oh, Amit spends a lot sense, of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. 
I suppose I could help if I have the time. If I have time. Oh, I'd okay. very much appreciate it. One of I the books you, is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you and could collect won't. them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Do, 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 do. It keeps switching them. How do I lock this track? First. And there we go. Relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was in. Like keep going, keep going. Running, 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 running. <laughs> Accio uh. Revelio Lumos Do all of the professors have their own books? I imagine they are Incendio Rebellion. There we go. It hasn't been the same since Black and Clover. Lucky for us, we have Professor Weasley. The headmaster hates everyone oh, who isn't a pure. We gotta go back to that one where we're gonna forget. Alright. Yeah, we do. It's a new. Oh, that didn't work. Are we going the wrong way? What is this? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Let me out, though. Yeah, it was up here, right? Up here, yeah. Revelio. There it is. Got it. Could have been bad. Alright, on the way. All the way. What is this? I only speak up in classes where the teacher doesn't deduct house points for wrong answers. Powerful path. Where I can claw. Keep trying, buddy. You'll illuminate. If I had to pick a professor. Do, 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 do. And we're off. Whoa. Beautiful. Beautiful. Rebellion. This is nothing. Lumos. This way. Really, you're just gonna cut through, huh? Revelio. That seems important. Ooh, How nice to see you, flying my young class friend. Oh, I can't wait for flying class. See this one. Thank you, Beast Classroom. Bro, if I could just get through and take that class. That'd be cool. Uh, oh man. Uh, back on the path. Uh, oh my gosh. Uh, just even allow. Uh, We're taking a shortcut, fam. Oh. Who uh, the woods? To grandmother's house we go. Wow. I don't think this is gonna work for us. What? I could make it work. I can make it work. Oh. <clears throat> oh. 
should have just <laughs> taken the river. Whoa. Coming in. Oh, we like Spider Man. We climb a wall. Not that wall. That wall, though. See? And then this one. Oh, we might be in trouble. Oh, we can go around. We can go around. Good jump, good jump. Ooh, not, not so good jump. We're getting hurt here. Rebellion. What's this right here? Uh huh huh. Oh, you see that up there? Question mark. We're gonna obviously like that. Lumos. Rebellion. Oh. Rebellion. What did I do? Rebellion Incendio It worked. And that's how you open this door right here. And the map, if you want to know where this is, right in here. Between uh, Hogsfield and Hogwarts. Lumos. We're going in. What we got in here? Rebellion. Loot. So that's how you find the Shaman Festival Garden. Wow, that's cool. Let's say we got something up here too. Possibly extra. Oh, that would be it. All right, moving on. Going around. Rebellion. We're getting a lot of um, supplies. Uh. I like it. Oh, we swimming. We have it all. Uh. Oh, we'll go over here. And there she is. Look at that. It is good to see you, my friend. Good to see you. It's good to see you. Girl. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. Everybody if you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. Mm. A bit odd, the two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us, to all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Sorona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. 
Uh, this could definitely be dangerous. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair on their own, and you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. Mm -hmm. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? Yeah. I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. Okay. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. I will, I will. All right, let's do a little... Uh... Rebellion. Source indeed. I beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What? What's going on here? Who got threatened? I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. Aww. I've nothing to sell now. Oh, I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, Bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Mm. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. You mentioned that your paintings were taken. Are you a painter? I am. It's my calling, though most <laughs> would think it an unusual path for a goblin. Most of my family work in metal, or associated with Gringotts. I'd wager my finest brush that Ramrock's lot have no appreciation for any of my work, and it'll be tossed aside for kindling. Without my carts and my livelihood, who knows when I'll be able to paint again. Has Ranrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? Oh, they've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. But they've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Yeah, Ramrock is way. getting more Sorry, powerful, bro. and his loyalists know it. They feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him, but he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. I'm sorry this out. happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your cards. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. I don't get it. Because when you think, like, I don't know. Rebellion! What do you think? Well, I'm gonna Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. But mummy, Archie, I don't have time to. Ask. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. But you should see the mummy. How beautiful! These what horses. Did I just get? What I want? Okay. Uh, upgrades. What else we got? Oh, no. Okay, that can stay. That's it. 
I see. Another wand handle. Ooh, look at that. That's what I just picked up. The wand handle, and I love that. That's going on. This has got to change. This is our guard sky. Mm -hmm. Nice, we're looking nice. Got lots of collections. Rose. <coughs> oh, that's enough. I'm too tired for your stories today. You stay right here where I can see you. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. Potion. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Yeah, you any remember? whispers going about the town? You may have noticed we have a bit of a rivalry with Upper Hogsfield. Not much to it, but we're still the better of the two Hogsfields. <laughs> better than most other places, too. That will be all. Thank you for your time. I don't need your potion. Revelio. Okay. Now. Lumos. Gotta keep the light on. I must have Rebellion. cut this way. Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with What's my going research. On here? I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student! You can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Yeah. Superfine. You regret crushing me, Incendio. Who that? I'll watch the light go out of your oh. eyes. No, you won't. The collection section of your field guide has been updated with a new enemy type. You may learn valuable insights on enemies, such as their weaknesses to certain stuff. Stop right there! Tango! We can hurt them! Come off! I thought there were any way to heal. You'll take this! You'll get your fucking game! I hate fights! Oh. Oh. I've had enough of this! Rebellion. Wow. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such what a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. Are you alright? Tell me what it is. I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Yeah, I'm pretty good. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. Hmm. Yeah, who is Priya? You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin, gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. Typical, hard-working Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner, has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a travelling vendor, hears what's going on in the Highlands before I do. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service, historian and archaeologist specialising in Merlin's work and life. I thought, Merlin, I thought was a that myth. Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan mm -hmm. didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. 
Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. How fascinating. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. Ooh, no one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial mm. clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the centre. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the centre of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honours? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Okay. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here. Revelio. As well as a stone swell on the ground. Mm -hmm. Each trial has these features. Place the mallow sweet on the swirl, and we'll see what happens. Placing the mallow sweet. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm. Incendium! It's a Merlin's beard! The flames oh make God. the pyre sink. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on? Curious. The pyres are back where they started. So I need to do it in a certain order. Incendio. Hardly believe it. I take it we can call that a success? Sure we can. can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. And do be Pleasure careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Bye, Nora. Quest complete, trials from Merlin. Well, folks, that's going to be it. For real, thanks for watching again. We already went to potions class today, and then we headed off to find out about the trials Greetings. of Merlin. Greetings. I understand you're quite the enterprising young Ravenclaw. Professor Fig tells oh, me you found a long-lost book for him. I'd like to talk to you about it. Okay, okay. So again, uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Most importantly, ding that bell so that when part five comes out, you're notified immediately. If you're liking what you watch, remember to hit the like button and comment below what your favorite scene so far has been. 
This is Papa Mystic. Out.